One of the new features inside the Civil 3D 2017 V1 enhancements is the ability to analyze a gravity network. The utility enables you to resize pipes, reset inverts, and to compute the energy grade lines according to the HEC 22 2009 standards. As you can see here in my model, I have a stormwater pipe network represented in plan view. And I've also shown it to you here in profile so that we can see whenever the new feature upsizes or changes the size of our pipe network. So we'll go over here to our toolbox and we will get in and analyze our storm pipe network. So we've got a few design parameters that we need to put in. We need to select a tailwater condition. We need to pick our analysis type. So we're going to have it resize pipes and compute energy and hydraulic grade lines. You have the option to select between curb inlets, grade inlets, and combination inlets. We'll use a curb inlet today. Punch in some additional design parameters. We'll give it a curb length of 7. We'll leave the rest of it alone. Today we'll just use a known flow. So we'll just use 5 CFS per inlet. So as you can see, you can bring in a custom rainfall file. So I'm going to go ahead and select the 25 year for my rainfall data. I'll apply my defaults. And I'll simply tell it where I need the bypass to go to and from. And I'll apply my defaults for my tributary areas. Notice that it is showing my cues that I have for my known queue. And I will select Analyze. Once we select Analyze, we have three different options. We can export the results to a CSV. And once that CSV file is, is saved, uh, we could go back and look at the results of that. We can also modify the results. And we can apply the results to our storm network. Now, once the results are set in our storm network, it not only updates the plan view and all of our labeling inside of our plan view, but it also updates our profile. And you can see the energy grade line and hydraulic grade line inside of the pipes. Again, not only have our plan labels, structures, and pipes updated in our plan view and our profile view, but we also have our Excel spreadsheet with all of our calculation data.